Hey guys, it's early morning. We're in West Hollywood and guess what we're doing today? Another male high def body contouring. The cool thing about this case is it's a primary one, meaning the guy's never had surgery before, doesn't have any scar tissue, irregularities or indentations. We're just going straight from a perfect canvas to be able to make an amazing result. High def lipo, for, especially for males, incorporates a number of technologies and, and techniques. So we're putting in the numbing solution right now that has some medicine in it to not only numb the area so when he wakes up he doesn't have pain, but also decrease any of the bruising because there's medicine in here that stops the bleeding. It makes it a really easy and safe case for the patient. As the fluid builds up in the skin, you can see some swelling in the tissue and some whitening. The whitening tells us that the fat is ready to be removed. We use ultrasound to kind of steam heat the fat get that fat ready for transferring. And that's the ultrasound technology that's kind of pushing away the fat cells gently so we can reduce the fat, help steam heat the skin, but also use that fat to lift his buttock. This gives us a better result with lipo shaping as, tr as compared to a non-energy based traditional lipo. So most men have problem areas of fat that they accumulate in the flanks, lower stomach, and chest. We've already done vaser in those areas. We're now focusing on bringing in his slide, sides and slimming his waist with the ultrasound. And then we're gonna use lipo techniques and internal heating to make it even more contoured and give him a V taper. And obviously we also physically remove the fat with a power assisted device. The other great thing about this patient is he doesn't have a lot of body fat. He's super athletic and his skin is really tight. So what we're gonna get is an ultimate six pack, an ultimate change. And the other really interesting thing about this is he doesn't have a uniform six pack. He has a little bit of asymmetry to his abs and you guys know I do natural abs. I do definition around the muscle that's there. I don't create a fake look. So in this case, we're gonna get much more contouring, much more natural shaping to the lower part of his chest. The second part will be internal heating uh, with the Renuvion radio frequency, the newest device to internally heat the skin. So doing some Renuvion tightening in the back will help give some contouring to the dimpling as well as the shaping of the buttock and tightening of the flanks or the love handles. The last part is the etching and the sculpting and then using the fat to create a muscular look which we're going to use for his buttock. We're adding fat now to the buttock to give it some size and lift. Nothing too big for a man, we just want it more uh, perky. It's gonna look uh, more blended with his new uh, contour on his back. So this actually adds a nice shaping to a man when they do the fat grafting. We're day one, not even 24 hours after doing high def body sculpting. I'm sure you were doing lymphatic massage right now. So you wanna be able to show the six pack is already being able to be seen. And after day one, it starts to swell up and you lose it a little bit, but you can see the contour along the lateral side of the chest and the, and the center and the bottom. You could see all of the six pack being created and the massage therapist is pushing the fluids off to the lymphatic channels to help get it to not only drain, but also decrease all the toxins that are in there from the lidocaine that's in the fluid, anything from anesthesia. Definitely does not feel good, which is why we do IV hydration at the same time and then hyperbaric oxygen therapy. So overall, it's going to give him a quicker healing time, uh, much less swelling, and we're gonna prevent scar tissue, seroma and hematoma, which is fluid and blood build up, build up as well by doing this so that we um, prevent any long-term complications. We want the best results.